Hey, 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 it's Dan Alive. You're on Dan Vision. Wheels and Waves car shows in the books. I decided to check out Ventura. And I am going to surprise my buddy, Johnny Martinez, Wicked Lines. As we're seeing Wicked, we used to be called Wicked and Suede. He doesn't know I was at Malibu. And he doesn't know I'm surprising him. And Johnny, it's Dano. Hey, Dano. Hey, check it out. Come all the way up from Malibu, Wheels and Waves. I want to check you out. What's going on here? Well, this is my nonsense here. This is what I do. This is where I do all my work, uh, all my paint work, and things I do for people and for myself, and where I hide out. Where you hide out, huh? Yeah. Wow, this is quite the the man cave, huh? Look at uh, this. It's, uh, it's uh, got a little bit of uh, me here, I think. Yeah, I got a whole lot of you. Look at projects going on i don't want to give any secrets away to anybody you got all my projects i've got uh all my uh well most i'm proud of in here is all my awards that uh that my hot rod is is acquired uh I, just about everything that i've ever uh won or was awarded uh is in here i've got uh i got 67 wins here and uh i think i've got some Ooh. in the house uh in a case that i have i've about run out of room um, and I've got some art stuff here as well, things people uh, have given me. Still uh, plenty of room to add on, right? Well, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, we got the other side of the, the man cave here to put stuff on, right? Well, we can, we can certainly try. <laughs> and I understand uh, when I went to Malibu, Wheels and Waves, and you were up to, what is that, Port Wainimi? The Seabees put a show on. And uh, it was my first time there. It was their third annual. And uh, I was lucky enough to win uh, Best Truck. And this is what I got. I got. I never go into a show, and this is the truth, I never go into a show thinking I'm going to win. Right. Uh, you know, you, you just don't do that. Uh, because if you lose, you're, you're disappointed. But I've been doing this a long time. And so, uh, so I went there and I saw these other trucks there and, and, uh, and I thought, well, you know, Wicked's got the new look, but uh, there's some nice stuff here. And come award time, they called my name and uh, I was really, uh, I, was, I was impressed. I was, I was happy and I was really surprised. So, I, uh, I think now that makes two major shows and two best ofs? Uh, I did a show when I picked the car up. Uh, when it just got finished and put together, I picked it up. I was due to pinstripe at a show there, uh, and uh, they had me there as a pinstriper, and they wanted me to offload the car uh, off the trailer and, and put it next to my booth. And I took best of show there. And uh, <laughs> so, uh, yeah. And that was for uh, Jacob uh, Makowski. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah Two Sun Breweries, I think it is. Right, Four, four Sun Breweries, and that was breweries. December. That was right. December. And so that was the very first show Wicked went to, and uh, and I got a best of show, and uh, and then this is the second show I've actually competed at. Wow! So I'm two for two, you know. <laughs> so I hope uh, you're not going to retire it. Well, no, I mean, you know what, uh, Dano, I'm having a lot of fun, and uh, you oh, know, yeah. I'm going to drive this thing. Uh, but as far as going out on the show deal again. Um, you know, I'm going to show it, uh, but I'm going to drive it. Right. Uh, I've been invited to go back to Grand Nationals for 2019. So Ooh. they're having a uh, tribute Model A uh, theme in 2019. and uh, But I've also been uh, uh, suggested that I go into the, one of the other buildings and actually compete. So I've got to decide how I want to do that. Uh, uh, Debbie Baker at Cruising for the Cure has uh, has asked me to come back to her show this year. Uh, they're going to have a um, a past hangar participant reunion building, and so she said she would like me to be there with with the new the new truck, and uh, so uh, I graciously uh, said yes. I'd love to be there. So I'm due for that one in September. Wow. Um, anything else in between this year? Uh, I'm just gonna play it by year. Right. Um, I've got some shows that I got to stripe at this year, and I got some awards that I'm making that I'm gonna be giving away, uh, that I'm sponsoring and giving away. So, more than that, Dano, I'm having a lot of fun with my friends, 
and the people that come up that I don't know uh, that want to talk to me. Uh, that's that's where my my real interest is now. Um, I got a lot of that at the classic uh, auto show this past uh, this past uh, uh, well just recently in in uh, wow. in March, and uh, yeah. I was there for three days. I was actually a pinstriper uh, there. Uh, I got reached out to, um, and uh, by the, uh, I always get it wrong, Urban Productions, it's the Urban Group that's associated with uh, Velocity Channel. They reached out to me, my name was dropped, and uh, <clears throat> so I talked to them, they asked me if I could bring in another artist, I did, Mike Donner out of right. uh, near San Diego, mm -hmm. and as you know, you were there, right. and uh, covering the show. So we were there for three days pinstriping and uh, getting back to the point, uh, people, I met so many people there that had an interest in what I, we were doing there. And uh, Mike and I had a great time and I met some wonderful people. So yeah. yeah. I didn't eat hardly any of it mm. because I was in my booth, but uh, I got up to go, uh, I, I was able to get up to uh, the Grand Boulevard. And man, I'm telling you, I, I've been to the Grand Nationals, I've been to the Bear Show. I've been to these big shows and the Grand Boulevard was, it was like a sea of candy. The cars were amazing. There was a lot of cars up there, people I knew. Uh, the lowrider guys, uh, oh. they knocked it out of the park oh, with, their, yeah. with their display, their, their candy color cars. But there was an array of cars there and uh, I'll tell you, it would have really been an honor to be up there in that, in that part of it. Um, yeah. uh, Rick Abatey with a Sinister. Uh, it was so appropriate, uh, but all the cars there, and uh, and I, I got to see uh, pretty much of that, but uh, most of the time I was busy. As you mentioned, Rick, he got an award for a Sinister, and our friend Chuck Showalter for Rodriguez. Yeah. He got the People's Choice Award. Yes, he did. Yeah. Chuck's, uh, Chuck's a good friend of mine, yeah. and uh, his car's uh, uh, so famous, so well-known. Yeah. And I've got to be good friends with Chuck, and there's a lot of camaraderie between him and I. But uh, we were talking about my shiny paint now, and uh, you know, and and we smiled at each other. And I said, "Well, now you know, I'm, I'm up there with the Rodriguez guy." <laughs> but uh, but yeah, there was a lot of a lot of fun things going on, and uh, and the awards that were given, um, you know, for for some of the people that I knew, um, you know, Kathy Gardner got uh, huh. uh, best hot rod, I think oh, it was something like that. Very popular win. Yeah. Yeah, that uh, crowd went crazy. Yeah, 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 you know, and I was so happy for her because she just uh, she just uh, awarded at uh, Grand Nationals in uh, January. Right. So that was a big, and I walked across that stage twice at Grand Nationals. Yeah. And so <laughs> I told her, I says, Kathy, I, I, I hope and I think you're going to walk that stage. There's nothing like it. And so she did that. And then to uh, to award at the classic show, wow. Yeah. You know. Yeah. What yeah her, her and Gary, you know, with, with what, what they're doing with the, community of the hobby yeah uh, yeah that's a, that's a brand new thing lifting off the ground that whole group over there in, in Huntington Beach I've been doing a lot of stuff out there in Orange County now for three years and I've met a lot of Orange County people and became friends good friends with them and they treat me so good it's a good group the Orange County Mustang people they're all doing good things yeah. uh, the new uh, uh, Surf City uh, uh, classics group. yeah the Surf yeah. City classics that, that's that's uh, coming up um, you know, it, it's just a, a fun group, and uh, and here I am in Ventura, California, you know, know. way down at the other end. <laughs> I know, we're, we're uh, uh, from, from over to Malibu to here, not too far, but from Orange County to here is uh, probably an hour and a half, two hours. Yeah, 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 well, I get that same thing when I go down south, but yeah. uh, but I'm over here uh, doing what I do, and uh, and I'm always anxious to get back out to Orange County to, to do what I do there, and I'll be there... Uh, I'll be there this year a few times doing uh, some things. I'm, I'll be pinstriping uh, at Pete's show. In, All right, Fountain uh, Valley in June. Fountain mm -hmm. Valley, uh, uh, car and truck show. Uh, and I'll be uh, pinstriping for Paul Montesano for uh, Edison Orange County people. Father's Edison. Day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and I got those things going on. I'll be building and, wow. uh, and awarding uh, awards for people. Yeah, that's uh, that's back to back weeks, I think, in June. Back to back, yeah. yeah. I almost think I should just stay out there, you know. Yeah. <laughs> well, Dano, I think you underestimate yourself. Mm -hmm. uh, you become uh, quite a bit more than I think you know, 
And, uh, you know, you've brought together, uh, you've been responsible for a lot of people coming together, uh, mm -hmm. bringing uh, what we all do to the people that are curious about this, this yeah. thing. And uh, well, your, thank name, you. uh, your name is synonymous to what we all do and what we all mean here. You know, thank um, you. Just trying to do my bit to you're, uh, you're keep the hobby friend, going. You're, you're a good friend to many, believe me. Well, Johnny, thank you for those kind of sentiments. I appreciate that. And I'm so glad I took a detour from Malibu to come up to see you today. <laughs> How about that? Well, I tell I, you, we don't uh, we don't have a bad life here. You know, I no. think I'm about four or five tenths of a mile from the water. Right. And uh, I go down to Fireball Tim's uh, event in Malibu, the Country Mart there. Right. And uh, and it's a lot of fun there. But uh, cruising up and down the beach uh, and near the shoreline, boy, I tell you, there's nothing like it. I'm yeah. glad you're here. Yeah, and also I uh, there's another famous person besides you here. Well, there's more, but uh, somebody that's my friend also, and that's Sage Erickson, Surfer Girl. Uh, I'm putting my my money on her to win the title this year. She lives here in Ventura. Well, uh, there's been a few people <laughs> come out of Ventura yeah. here that uh, we got famous Sea Street up the road here, right. uh, where a lot of the uh, where a lot of those veteran guys surf and. Uh, and we got the older guys there with uh, the long gray hair that are still carrying boards <laughs> yeah. under their armpit, you know. Right. But, uh, yeah, it's uh, it's good to know that uh, in that world there's still those people. And they're just as big, you know, in their world. Right. Uh, I'm new here. I've only been here less than a year. Right. So I'm still making my way. I'm paving myself through here. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's a lot of fun. It really is. Well, cool, Johnny. Thank you for uh, letting me surprise you like this. And... Uh, Appreciate your time you're spending with me here, and the audience will just love this. So, as I always say, thank you very much. Thank you, Dan. I and appreciate it. I'm going to bow out here and just run the camera down, All Wicked. Uh, are we going to give it a new name, Wicked something? Or? Well, I, right now, this is where we're at. Okay. Uh, if you look at this picture right here. Wicked 29. That's okay. kind of where it's at. A friend of mine, Eddie Mandela, in, in Wichita Falls, Texas, did that for me. Uh, and, uh, right now I think that's where I'm at, uh, Wicked 29. Okay, because uh, that's where we were. That guy right there, uh, this guy here did this one years back for me. A guy named, uh, Dave Cusimano, they call him the Coos. Okay. And he did that for me, and that was, of course, as you know, when my, uh, hot rod was, uh, satin black. And, uh, as you know, it was Wicked and Suede, and it kind of mm -hmm. made his name there, you know, made bones there. Uh, and I even had show signs, uh, but I can't use those signs anymore. So they end up on my wall. And uh, now I've got to uh, come up with uh, a new name. So I think Wicked 29 is uh, yeah, that's, possibly uh, what it might be. Right. Huh? I think everybody would be very pleased and accept that name. Wow, look at these awards. That orange one right there is my Grand National win uh, in 2013, and I won this in 2016. Three years later, same class, uh, I took a second place in the same class I took first in, and I got beat by a famous truck, which was an honor to actually be beat by this guy. And the same year that I won this in 2016, I was competing for the Perseverance Award, which was a real, real prestigious award. And that's given to somebody who has suffered health catastrophe while mm. trying to put a car together. And I got suggested for this award to compete for it. And it's a personal award. So in 2016, I took second place with Wicked. And later in the evening, hmm, they called my name up for that. Wow. And there I am with John Buck, the owner of Grand right. National. And that young lady right there has become my friend. That's Haley Carpenter. She's a pinup model. And she won a pinup model that year. And there they are presenting me with the Perseverance Award. And this was just a suggestion of what my award was. And what I got was a, uh, was a rendering of my hot rod, me in it, driving in front of Bob's Big Boy in Toluca Lake. Wow. And uh, maybe in another day I'll bring it out and show it to you. Wow. And that was my actual... Uh, award and it was presented to me by Steve Young and uh, and he came to me at Grand Nationals and shook my hand and uh, I uh, this 
was a pretty emotional award because of the cancer. And uh, my wife and I both suffered cancer during my build. So that was the basis for my award. So it was wow, a very emotional yeah. night. And I can see why it is front and center right here in your main workbench. Yep. Wow. wow. I've been blessed, uh, yeah. Dano. I've been really, really, really blessed with uh, good people, um, people that believe in what I do, and uh, it's just, uh, it's just been snowballing. Yeah. I'm a very lucky man. <laughs> yeah. Well, Johnny, you're good to everybody. I thank you again. Thanks again. Very Dano. much. Thank you Thanks very for much. having me in. We'll Welcome bow anytime. out here and see what Wicket looks like in Johnny Martinez's man cave. Look at that.